What about planning? Because what we really like to use these cube uh, technologies for is all this planning. So let's just have a quick look at that. So here's a good example. So I've just got a piece of the PL here. And it's got three months of actuals, and I'm in a forecast, and I just want to do the rest of the nine months. So let's say I start with 3,000 or 3 million. I can just type like normal Excel. I can use all of normal Excel's technology. And then if I look to calculate it, you can see that number's calculated, that number's calculated. But what is happening when I'm typing? Let's go back to that SQL world. And let's have a look at um, this table here called the same name as the cube called finance. I'm just going to ask to see the top 1,000 rows. So you can see the three millions in here. So now I'm going to go in and I'm going to put in a number that's kind of very obvious to us. 888,000. Put a few of those in. Now, as soon as I've put them in Excel, it's used Olation and loaded it straight into the SQL world. There's those 888,000s. Now, you can just imagine how powerful that is. All your hard work in Excel, going into a SQL database, proper backups, proper enterprise security, it's amazing. And you're not going to find a tool that fits so well uh, with SQL Server. So if you've got SQL Server, this is the tool for you. Thank you.